Greetings YouTube and welcome to today's How Good Is This Offer According to Prof Hoff's Questionable Math Skills where I try to break down today's offer and tell you how many units I think it's worth. I love when these kind of offers come into the game because there isn't a player that these kind of things couldn't help unless you're like me and you already have the 30% greater champion boost in your overflow. Hopefully I can take care of that before the end of the month. But I'm going to break this down in reverse order because sometimes it's fun to change things up. And I actually think the best part of this deal isn't the two greater champion boosts. It's the three, uh, it's the level three, excuse me, team revives that you get five of because these are items that are so crucial to beating really tough content, including this month's uncollected quest. And you cannot buy these for units. In fact, a lot of this you cannot buy for units in the unit store so a level three team revive based off of what the level two and level one cost i think you value those at a minimum at 200 units a piece so even if they just said give us 800 units for five level three team revives and that's it that technically would be like 20 to 25 percent off the value that I think they hold, even though that probably is even a little conservative because you can't get them normally except in these offers. Now, level two revives you can get, and we know what a level two revive is valued at. It is valued at 40 units, so five of those is another 200 units worth of value. Level four health potions, we also know what those are valued at. Those are 21 units a piece or 105 units total worth of value. And then you've got these boosts, three of them. The greater health boost and the greater attack boost, I think conservatively, I would value those at about 50 units apiece. So between the two of them, that's about 200 units worth of value. And then there's these big mega plus 30% greater champion boost, one of those amazing items you can only get in special offers. I think they are conservatively valued at at least 200 units apiece, but you could argue they're 300 units given how much, I think it's 90 units for a lesser champion boost, that's 10%. These last a full hour as well, so they're just incomparable. All of that math adds up between the 1,000 units for the level three, three team revives, the 40 units for the level two revives, the 21 units for the level four health potions, uh, and then the 50 units for the 25% of the greater health and the greater attack. And then, of course, the creme de la creme of this featured offer, the 30% greater champion boost to 1,905 units, according to my math, or about 2,000 units when you factor in the importance of the rarity of these items. So you're getting essentially 60 65% off what you would normally pay, even though I think that's a conservative estimate because most of these items, if you suddenly needed them or wanted them, you couldn't access them no matter how many units you had because they weren't available readily in game. So now the question is, should I get this? If you have the units available to get this and you still need items to complete 100% this monthly uncollected quest or maybe act four or act five, I say go for it. But if you don't know what you'd use them on and you don't have the units and you'd have to spend actual money on this, I say hard pass. Wait for something better. Again, I made a video earlier this week trying to tell you that the uncollected monthly quest offer, while very pricey at 4,250 units, is a really good value because not only do you get a ton of five-star shards, but also you control when you see the offer in your after your initial first uncollected run, assuming you are uncollected. And so you, you don't have to worry about suddenly something like this popping up and being like, crap, every time something good pops up, I don't have the units. I, I see that comment all the time, and maybe that's you right now. Sorry, buddy, if that's you. But regardless, if you've got the units and you need to beat some really tough content, I would say snatch this up. If you don't know what you'd spend this on or you don't have the units, I'd say pass. But this is about 60 to 65%, maybe even 70% off the normal retail price of the value in the game. So I hope that helps you break down today's offer. Good luck to everybody in your questing today, and as always, thanks for watching.